Lauren wants to see blood. The blood of the demon possessed evil masked whatever demon friend. Even half of his team abounded him. But he's still some kind of badass. But we are pretty confident with six people we can take on this guy. And Lauren wants to see blood, so let's give it to this guy. We have a few things, but we will not go through them now. Okay, let's give it to this guy. Heart. Or maybe you can give it to this guy. Bang! This guy wants to get more damage. Bam, stack rain. Oh, we'll back and not a little bit and have rain of arrows, but Lauren dodged. So, these guys don't like fireballs, if I remember correctly. Let me say that. Oh, I'm sorry. I hope this is slightly uncomfortable. Yeah, slightly uncomfortable. Sure. Let's <laughs> slice them up. What? Nine? Nine? It's critical to what? Higher attack. Okay. Don't think we have that. This demon possessed guy is easy to scare, but he's basically immune and he's resistant to normal attacks. Well, I guess he has nothing with normal, so let's smack his face. I don't know why we do so less damage then, I don't get it, but. There will be a reasoning, I guess. Yeah, shows us guys. Stings him. No He's burning. What? Stop shooting at her. So slightly dressed. No, that is destroying our relationship with Lauren. Stop fooling around with us and our emotions. Take that. Ah, he's tired now. What does it do? Magic value, lowers air resistance. You do air damage with that, or? But you are scared. Defense value, uh, nobody cares about defense value. Well, that would be death jump, but... It's kind of a waste. Let's I hope this finish is this guy is uncomfortable. To help him. Slice him, very good. Now we, he takes some damage. Can you blast that guy? Yeah, that looks good. I'm sorry. You're sorry? They trying to kill you. A lot. Like, they really do. Let's hear And you should be thankful to Eleanor that she even helps. I show you! Oh, Dora, we all love you. You're great. You are great. And this demon possessed bastard is going down. Stop shooting it. Sets him up, Eleanor. Lost his face. Okay, now he's stuck struggling. Lost Good him. Red Wham! Oh, no more harm! Sets take it, you bastard. And we got found a red moon pearl. And we go. And the relationship destroyer leveled up. These allies in a row by 40%? Okay. That's 30%. This is first damage was slow. I have still no idea what overdrive does. Freeze in alignment. Spells, good point. That actually seems to be pretty useful support skill who takes that. And you need more magic and a little more strength to not die like a fly. Okay. <coughs> Is he still alive? Didn't we kill that bastard? Come on. Blood trickled from Mephit's mouth. The exhausted party watched him fall to his knees, openly bleeding. Yeah. Mephit. My people need... Justice! 
He corked and fell onto the ground, his wounds turning the sand red. The only sound was the howling wind as everyone waited for him to die. Instead, he seemed to be in agony. So Lauren approached him with her sword and mercy ready. No! Tobar is that old guy. But Lauren, please mercy for this bastard. Really? The elder dark elf hobbled quickly and fell by Masford's side, cradling his head closely. The root leader could barely keep his eyes open, but tried to find the elder with his hands. Father! I'm here. I'm so sorry. Look at you. You are everything we strive to erase. I will put him out of his misery. Yeah, Lauren, put him out of his misery. Toba quickly showed a desperate look at Lauren, knowing that his son was in pain and that he had done wrong, but also still clutching tightly to him. Never let go. Eleanor felt a hand on her leg, and she looked down to see her struggling to stand. She whispered something as she got all the damage under her breath, but she could not hear her. Instead, Eleanor helped her to stand. We are too nice to that bitch. We are some closing girl. Wait! Her hoarse voice was much clearer now. Eleanor searched her eyes and found not only tears, but sympathy. Nurse looked to her husband, crashing next to them to place her own hands on the fallen world. Forgive me. Her hands began to glow when she attempted to heal him. You must live. You. Do not let them consume your life as well. Fight your blood. Fight it, son! As did not seem to be recovering, he just caught and was losing a lot of blood. Eleanor could no longer stand it and rushed to her side, using her healing magic as well. We are way too nice. I have some requests. Um, Forum, I post this to make a second playthrough with a guy and try to romance this chick. I get where you are coming from, but guys, now we are Eleanor, okay? Yeah. Clear your dirty thoughts or buy the game yourself, it's worth the money. Maybe I do it later. Together, their healing magic undid everything the party had just inflicted on him and his walls closed. Tough, the bleeding had stopped. Method was still prone and in pain. He will live, but it will take time for him to recover completely. You, you saved him. Everyone deserves a second chance. She and Tober exchanged a look, not of understanding or trust, but of compassion. The sun began to set over the desert town. Stop Mathfield. That stopped him. I didn't think we destroyed the demon. He just well, okay. Let's level up. You get completely strength because you know. Do we have a skill point here? Increase the dungeon with 15. So now we can get push one, and that's what I wanted. Let's push people around like they push us around. Good one. So Lauren, uh, Eleanor is now level 5, gets no skill. So let's increase some skill and willpower. Please. And Lauren. Ah, Lauren. Right, the speed and defense. You need some speed desperately. No skill points? Okay. Very good, let's continue. Mutual trust was far away for those two factions. Toba had tried to prove that they should not be judged for their past, but their past was so horribly made present by his own son. 
We're safe, Masford, said they, out of guilt and pity, but it was the first movement towards peace between the forest elf and the dark elves in a hundred years. It was just enough to restore hope in those dark times, and they were going to need it. Now oh, we are back in the wood willow. Murst asks that Masford be taken away from Tower's village to recover so that the forest could not send him anymore. In return, Tobor asked for an alliance and the exile of the Dark Elves to end. Moose promised to begin negotiations, but warned that it would not be a quick or easy process. The party went back into the heart of the forest, into the forest elves' village. It looks, still looks like not the heart of the forest. Where they had first started. There they recovered from their long journey and Merce finally prepared for her divination ceremony. It would take several days and require complete isolation, so Lauren was left to wait. Okay. Town Fame 3. Well, let's have a look in our inventory and what we have here. So we have a standard X. Okay, how's that? Oh, wait, no! It's not what I wanted. This has more speed, more attack, less damage, less crit. So this is Shattering Sword, medium edged weapon. Nice, does earth damage. Blade Hawk, the Holy Orc Blade, no drop. Wow, okay. You sure we cannot sell it for one thousand? That's incredibly good. It does attack, HP, regen, damage like crazy, crit like crazy, defense, speed, SP, regen, whatever it does. That, uh, let's go with it. And uh, let's see what this is. Standard longsword. Is this your tempered longsword? Standard eggs, I don't know. Let's give her the Shattering Sword, which seems also to be only better and to burst damage. Okay. What is this here? Hell Crossroads. 375. Okay. Let's have a look how this stuff compares to yours. This is strictly better and does fire damage. Nice. And this is has a little less speed, but otherwise it's strictly better. Well, you are in row one now, so let's look what she has here. She has this redwood bow too, eh? Let's give her this. And you get one of those redwood bows. And you get... You can't use any of this because you can only use throwing weapons. Do I get this right? Yeah. What do we have here? Okay. Way more speed. So whatever you have here, standard war axe is clearly better. Okay. Get it. And you have this, which gives you defense value. Which is actually pretty nice. You have 46 defense, you have 63. Okay, never mind. You stay behind. I'm tempted to give you this, but... The defense seems more useful since you are in the back row. We will, but we'll keep it for the moment. We will not sell it. Let's keep it as this. So armor-wise, we have shoulder pads for everyone, don't we? Yeah, so we can sell this. What's that? Plate mail. Wow, crazy defense, minus speed, threshold, plus three. Mm -hmm. Okay, more defense. Way more defense. Fine chain mail. Chain mail. Let's give it to you, you're our heavy duty guy. 
anybody else weirds at here? You could. You too. Minus three speed. But you're in the front row, so let's take it. Okay, so what's that here? Bark plate, shoulder blades. That sounds like something for Lauren, does it? Yeah. What's that here? Leather shawl. Leather shawl. Okay. So minus two speed, one attack, nine defense, five damage. Damn it. Well, it seems like you hit this bar plate, shoulder plate in the face of someone, which is okay with me, so let's go. We have potions, that's good, that's all fine and dandy, okay. So we have not enough gold, let's do some task. We tried that stuff already, so let's clean some Tomb of Under. Oh yeah, is it so? And you go back. Yeah, sh of course, she's preparing her ritual. So let's see on that. What do we have here? Skeleton Warrior B. Skeleton Warrior A and C. Resist fire and that's un not nice. Resist, resist critic shattering damage. We don't have that. It's a really scare. Makes sense. Attack 34, attack 31, speed 96. So you're a skeleton speed, huh? And you have 49 aggro in your crew and you all have zero assistance. So he has level 4 skeleton archer. Which has the same armor as the mod. They also like Amazon armor style and show us all their wealth. And he's 112 speed, so he's way faster than you guys. So so you are the leader, huh? Necromancer, level 6. Got it. Level 2. Also weak against fire, huh? Immune to frozen. Resist water. Okay. 105. Okay, you don't have the fire bonus. Huh? They are in. Let's get it on. <laughs> Bam! Red So you don't need this fire on the hand. But you do. Yeah, you do. Okay. In your face. 81. This new bow is crazy good. Here's everybody of condition. So I'm not good at this. But okay. Oh, he's already staggered. Oh, he healed them up too. Oh, that's pretty nasty. Try this on for size. Yeah, but burn them. Fighting back. Can we push this guy back now? Oh, we can because he's staggering. Go back, you noob. This. Okay. Which position, really? I don't like that. How is he scared? He's immune to being scared. Oh, whatever. Can I push him back? Could gain some, generate some aggro, which seems kind of useless. Let's slash. Wow, we do a shitload of damage with a new weapon. This new blade is crazy good. Hey, you go back again. Oh God, I hate. You. But at least he does nothing else while he does that. So I guess it's okay. Learn from this. <laughs> learn from this. Yeah, new skeleton. Learn something. I hope this is slightly uncomfortable. Guarding him. It hurts. He lived. 54. Not enough. Okay, so. Oh, so. To Sam we do. Ah. Uh, just damage will do Sam. Camouflage. None of Sam has anything you could. Abuse, right? You can abuse this, you know, you can do this, but target needs to be something of this, which they are. And no one is staggered, so you can't use this. Oh, wait, he's staggered. Let's do this, oh, that's good. Now he defends. Let's kick this boy, because he used it. 
can see it because of this. Yeah. Let's push the gun back. Well, they switch position, the same we always do, but the good thing is, they cannot make use of their abilities. For some reason this makes paralyzed but slow. Which I would have really thought it down. Oh, okay. Oh you you are scared. Even if you are immune to being scared. So let's freeze you up. Oh it worked. Oh awesome. This is awesome. Let's max this one out. Why are both there? Now you can headshot him with a sniper. Which is pretty useless because he's nearly dead. Let's clean them up for several. Oh, he died from what? Frozen maybe? I guess he died from frozen. Let's go. Rama 7. Frozen causes 38 HP damage. Wow. Pretty good. Pretty damn good. Let's push that guy in front so they switch. Oh, they cannot switch. He staggered. Oh, he has no one to protect him anymore. And he's not fire resistant. Now in let's see if anything good on that's it for regenerating, see so he's still not really like Either I'm really good or they really weren't. <laughs> I'm really good or they really right. weren't. Let's eat. Say weren't. Let's eat. I'm agreed, let's eat. And we got some nice stuff. Staff of enlightenment sounds awesome. Doesn't look awesome, but it sounds awesome. Oh and we can level up. Do you get more willpower I guess? Kill one more here and one willpower because you really don't have enough energy to cast your stuff. We got her a lot of skills to cast, so we should improve her energy a little. Oh, plus five reputation, nice. Let's go to the shop. Do we? We get no bonus on selling, only on buying. So let's sell some stuff. This, this. And this. And... Uh, we have no one who can use this anymore. But we will keep it for the moment. We will sell this. And this eggs. And what does this do? Set is shit too. And we don't need this anymore. Okay. So now we have a little bit of money. Can we leave here? Party was well rested and fully prepared to travel again. Lauren was an anxious to find her mother, but the elves warned her not to disrupt Elder Dreamhill's divination ceremony or it would be ruined. Hmm, that's bad. I thought we maybe could go to the global map and do something now and then come back to shop more. If I would have known it doesn't work that way, I would have done some more things for town fame and beat up some losers to gain new items and gear up for future battles, you know. Well, okay. After the longest several days in her life, Lauren was finally approached by Mercer herself. The druid smiled warmly. And what this is all about? We will find out, and you know when in the next episode of Lawrence Amazon Princess.